something that is very close to my heart is that uh, heat is a very social hazard. So if you have an aircon and a pool, you essentially don't care about heat because you can cool yourself. And on the other side of things, if you live in a slum housing, uh, we know that people will eventually sleep outside uh, during a heat wave, which might expose them to um, other risks like malaria, or like violence, sexual violence, etc. And so there's this yeah, absurd aspect of justice that comes with heat. And that's something that we are agnostic in our analysis because we're on a city scale and average. Um, but it's something that we know we there, uh, is there. And it's something that we really should think of and take care of that it's actually uh, those that are already in a bad position that will actually suffer more. So it's like in this narrative of um, we are not in the same boat, but we're in the same storm. It's like some have a really good boat, others are probably swinging already. And we should always keep that in mind if we look at these climate extremes.